This video is a demonstration of the installation of a cold shrink joint with separate rejacketing, or CSJ-SR. Before you begin, be sure to check that you have the proper kit using the kit selection table in the installation instructions. Prepare the cables for installation as shown in the installation instructions. Slide the splice body and separate rejacketing over the cable so that the release strips of the spiral hole belts point away from the end of the cable. Install the selected shear bolt or compression connector based on the connector's installation instructions. A TE aluminum shear bolt connector was chosen for this demonstration. Be sure to check the fail-safe dimensions before finishing connector installation to ensure proper cable cutback dimensions. Abrade the insulation and then clean the insulation using approved solvent. Clean and degrease the connector area. Install several turns of the marking tape onto the cable semicon as an installation guide on the opposite side from where the splice body and rejacketing sleeve are parked. With a gloved hand, apply blue discharge control compound to the cable insulation. Coat and fill in all voids on the cable's insulation, including the semicon step. Pull the splice body out from underneath the separate rejacketing. Align the splice body with the marking tape and slowly release the spiral holdout to install the splice body. As the body begins to recover, reposition the splice as needed to ensure it is butted up against the leading edge of the marking tape. The splice body cannot be repositioned after it is fully recovered. Apply mastic under the neutral wire. Apply protective white cloth tape where the neutral connector will be placed based on the installation instructions. Position the neutral wires down along the installed splice pot. Use tape to secure them as shown in the installation instructions. Connect the neutral wires by bundling them and installing a shear bolt or compression neutral connector. A TE copper shear bolt was chosen for this demonstration. If external ground is used in the neutral connection, connect the ground braid to the system ground following your company's bonding and grounding standards. Install white cloth and vinyl tape over the neutral connector.
Place the rejacketing marking tape per the installation instructions. Align the rejacketing sleeve with the marking tape and pull the holder. Install the gray sealing mastic on each end of the splice. Clean the separate rejacketing of grease and contaminants for a strong bond between the sleeve and mastic. Slide the rejacketing sleeve over the tape neutrals and mastic and onto the cable jacket. Tear off or carefully cut off the red mesh sleeve. Installation is now complete.